Hello everyone and welcome. This is Jim and uh, this time we're doing a little small little intro on Fishing Planet, the ultimate fishing simulator. And by golly, it's one of the fastest growing simulation games out there going right now. Um, anyway, disclaimer here, I'm not an expert at fishing. Uh, I've never been, I've been fishing, but I've never been told how to fish that well. So uh, this is new for me. Anyway, let's get to it. Oh, this is one of the uh, scenes that we'll get from the Mudwater uh, River uh, in Missouri. There's seven maps, and um, you'll have to excuse my voice. I don't know what's up with my voice, but I'm losing it. Um, this is one of the screens that will show you what you have on hand. Uh, basically, it's either at home or in your backpack, and your backpack will carry only so many items. Um, but uh, you, you see the lures and the baits and the, and the uh, hooks and the floats. Um, and there's no reels because they don't have enough room for it. Um, I have two rods and reels are, that, are, that are fixed up. And this is what's on each one of them. And there's, uh, this is the casting one and the other one was the float one. Or this is the spinning one the other one was the casting one. I'll get it right eventually. And every map has their own store. But um, you'll see that uh, uh, the individual maps themselves, stores, nah, very limited. Uh, but uh, here, the next, next place we can go to is New York. And um, you see it's kind of expensive to buy the license. Plus it costs you to travel there also. So, you know, you have to manage your money very well. Yesterday I was out of money, but uh, as you can see, I've been busy uh, catching a lot of bass and that's uh, a lot of uh, points and a lot of money. Um, this page will show you your achievements on the right here. Uh, all the achievements you can achieve, can get and what you have get and how, how much you have to get to get to the next level of your achievements. Uh, your second one is your trophies. The one in the middle place there is your trophies uh, for your trophy fish. And uh, on the left there, that's your stat page, stat area. And it just gives you a little over, run, run around uh, or overrun of what you've done so far. And uh, I'm level six, headed for level seven, and I need 399. Uh, this is the first page of the map and the map you see the little squiggly line there this will show you the best times to fish um, in this area it gives you the temperature and all that kind of good stuff in the time so you know four o'clock is, is four o'clock right now so it's pretty much fished out for this day um, other things that are coming this uh, this game is not complete as of yet there's they're constantly doing something for it so let's go down down to the riverside. And we'll do some float fishing here first off. And you use your uh, WASD buttons to uh, move around. And you just move around this one little area here. And uh, cast out. And um, you notice the, the uh, uh, bobber is not quite straight up and down so um, and also the bait is wrong I'll show you here in just a second why uh, on the on the bottom right hand corner there's a circle and in that circle uh, the outer part of that circle is your drag how much drag you have on that and it's done in increments and you do it by the plus or minus key and the little arrow in the bot in the middle is your uh, um, reeling speed um, the one to the left there, 27 out of 118 feet. 118 feet is the amount of line you have on your on your rod. I'm getting some hits there. And you're out 27 feet. There's 27 feet of line out from your reel. Um, I'm using, uh, as you can see up the right hand corner, a number six hook with uh, red worms. And if I'm doing catfish, that's that's the wrong thing to do. This is good for red worms are good for panfish, as far as I'm concerned, um, and crappies and, and bluegills. Um, over the left, we'll give you your stats for the day, what's going on, temperature, and all that kind of good stuff in the time. And bottom left is the uh, chat room 
where the other people who are in that room, oh, look at that. I, it disappeared and I caught something. Yep, bluegill. Not even a half a pound. So I'll release him. And um, let me show you some other fishing here real quick. Okay, this is a casting. Um, here, I'm using the uh, silver spoon um, uh, to catch uh, perch, or not perch, but bass. And um, to use from some of the places I've, I learned yesterday, as a matter of fact, you have to do this thing called twitching, which you see right there. And there's three dots, that means I'm doing it very well. Two dots, not so well. One dot, um, not as well, e even so. And then uh, not doing it at all. You don't catch a fish, you'll never catch. Cast, just in like real life. Um, so we'll just try a different place. Now I heard oh, that the um, that hit the ground, so uh, I, I my force was too hard. So we just go about three quarters of the way, and we'll put it in right there, and we'll twitch, 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 and you do that with pressing your left button, mouse button down, and then click, 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 click on your right mouse button, and that gets that, that twitching motion. And once that bait disappears, just like down, you've got a fish. And by the way, I, by the uh, pressure that's on that line on the right hand side there I can tell it's a pretty good fish and you can't lose fish from over and then lose themselves look here yep almost a pound large uh, young largemouth bass now if I had different um, uh, bait on there you could have more uh, bigger bass and you get bigger it's more achievement points and that's the name of the game is getting those achievement points so we'll go out here again to the right of the boats and we'll twitch here and we'll twitch and twitch a little bit more and see if that bait will disappear if the bait disappears we've got a fish There we go. Yep. And it's another good one. Now I can only release these because my stringer is completely full. And uh, yep, uh, almost a pound again. Nine point point nine three pounds. Uh, a lar young largemouth bass and four achievement points. So we get back here and from. that's like and your line will not go as far out as as with uh, this as you did um, with the other line with the other reel and pole and again you see that the the bobber the bobber is a little off to the right there a little it's not straight up and down straight up and down means it's it's okay um, that means you're on the bottom or close to the bottom so we, we re redo our leader to about 96 i think I'll, i set it for and there you go your bobber is, your float is sitting straight up and down this is how you catch catfish now change your bobber change your bait change your uh, or change your float i mean not your bobber change your float and uh, you have a better chance of getting a bigger catfish also and also change your bait in different times of the day. Oh, there we go. Okay, we got something there. And it's pretty big, so uh, you can tell it's not one of those bluegills. And there you go. A nice 1.4 pound, 14-inch um, young channel catfish. Uh, nine experience points. That's pretty good. I can do that all day long and, and uh, level up pretty quick. But it gets di more difficult the more you get into it. So again, here's uh, the, I've gotten 36 points. Um, 
just one little bit of us fishing there. Um, now I'm going to go back home. And this is uh, home home. This is where I can find all my stuff that I've bought that I can't uh, get. And you'll have these screens come up and tell you how, how much you did this day and uh, for the week, actually, for, and also for the week. You see there I had one line break and six snags, so uh, I consider that a win. Uh, $52 and 317 points, achievement points, so uh, that was pretty good. So the first thing you notice when you're at home is you, you'll see the, the store is much bigger, much bigger. It carries everything, everything that, that uh, they sell. And the outfits, um, not necessarily good, are, are there for just looks, but uh, they give you an increase in taking tackle and uh, line and reels. Uh, say this one takes six, six uh, or this one here will take seven reels, or seven rods and reels, plus two extra reels. Come in handy when you're in different, when you're, say, in Oregon. Uh, one of the things I learned yesterday also, in, in some of the videos I watched on YouTube, and I'm leaving a description uh, below, that this spoon right here was probably one of the best ones to catch bigger cat or bigger bass and again you know, different different styles uh, different wear and or uh, tackle boxes which will give you more also so if you get that in a tackle box you're getting more you'll be able to carry more items with you to another to another map and that's very very important This is this is takes gold. This takes the uh, gold coins. So anytime you see something that takes gold coins, it's premium. It's uh, probably one of the best things you can really invest in. All the different kinds of hooks are here. There's more hooks there than there were in the other other store. And then stringers uh, or fish keepers also. Uh, this I need to upgrade mine because uh, I can only get to up to 13 pounds uh, so I need to get a little bit more and it'll only take three pounds where that one there takes seven pounds seven pound fish um, what are with fishing licenses baits wise um, everything you'd want to see corn uh, I never thought of using corn or uh, peas, peas for uh, catfish and carp, uh, semolina bowl, balls, marshmallows. I'd never heard of marshmallows before, but it's, you know, they say they're, they're good and they're secret, blah, blah, blah. Plus, they'll give you a nice little sugar fix, too. And they start you out with bread and um, red worms. And then you have the worms here with the red worms and the uh, maggots and uh, uh, flies and crickets. Uh, night crawlers, which are a premium price, so and they'll catch the best fish. Not necessarily, but most of the time, you know, you can do just as good with crickets. I hear are the best to get, but again, it's gold, so it's premium, so it's good. And then we'll go over here to cut bait. We get uh, uh, get minnows. Large cut bait and uh, blood bait. Oh, blood bait's a little bit for there we go. Blood bait, uh, shrimp, and these uh, these here spawn. Those are for salmon, and then the crawfish cut. And so you see, there's all different kinds of uh, of bait you can use just for the fishing in the area that you're, you're fishing, also. either but you know, they're there so they must be good. I've only used night crawlers to be honest with you. Also in this game it, it does have a tutorials that you can uh, you can go through and these are the top 100 players in the game. Uh, the one on the right here is by fish. So 
Greasy, my little one point, one and a half pound catfish would not even rank near any of the top 100. As well as there, 6.8 pounds, so I'm gonna have to step up my game just a little bit. On the left is top 100 overall. I don't understand the rankings on this one because uh, um, I think somebody's got cheated or something, but um, you figure out the guy down here on in the 13th has more fish than the guy in the number one place does. So um, somebody's got a hack somewhere. I know there are hacks out there. I've seen them. Um, uh, but I don't think that's quite fair. So uh, I'm not going to hack. Uh, I, I'll just fish the way I, I can. But up top here, you see my, my money, my coins, my 38 coins. There is a premium shop also. You can buy credits uh, for like 10,000 credits for $60. Um, if you really want to go into it really hot and heavy, go for it. You know, you're, it's all, all, all there for you. And then on the left hand side is the premium accounts, also, which are for better maps, uh, achievements in the maps. And here's my three and a half pound channel catfish that, that I caught just to prove that I can catch catfish. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. I know you'll enjoy this game. See you later.